In this month's Essay Life magazine, I'm going to tempt you with some beautiful Asian-inspired recipes. Amongst my favourite are Thai fish cakes. Beautiful, simple and healthy. In this bowl, I've got some Atlantic salmon and some prawns, which I've put into a food processor and using the pulse button, I've just chopped them up quite chunky. So you can see it's not over-processed. You can also use flathead or snapper fillet, any fish that's really firm fleshed. Now, to this we add some fish sauce. I've put in a tablespoon and egg, a teaspoon of white sugar, a tablespoon or more of red curry paste, and some herbs. I'm using basil and coriander. You also need to shred up very, very finely some kaffir lime leaves and pop those in. And a handful of very finely sliced green beans. Now it's really so much easier to put on a pair of gloves and mix this really, really thoroughly with your hands so that the red curry paste is evenly distributed right through the fish. A good tip when you're making these is to fry a little bit of the mixture and then taste it and adjust it for flavourings. You might want a little bit of extra curry paste or some more fish sauce. And when you're happy with the flavour, you can start frying them all up in batches of about four or five until they're golden on both sides and cooked right through. You know, Thai fish cakes make a beautiful light entree, but they're also fantastic as a cocktail food. This recipe makes 12, but you can easily double it if you need more. I'll also include a recipe for a relish which complements these fish cakes beautifully. I like to serve these with some cucumber, some shredded carrot and maybe some extra sweet chilli sauce. So if you'd like to try this recipe, download it from our website. I'm sure you'll love it.